At the start of the pandemic, doctors and first responders and others were deemed essential workers. Well, so are custodians. Channel 5's Monica Deanda spoke with one school staffer about his job in helping students stay safe during the pandemic. Make sure everything's sprayed down. Stairways. You know, any surface that the kids might touch. Meet Roberto Quintanilla. He's got 20 years of custodial experience under his belt, but COVID-19 took his job to a whole new level. This comes off and just fill it in. Pop it back in. We're ready to go. Every day, Quintanilla arrives by 5 a.m., hours before kids set foot on campus to make sure everything is disinfected. And when students start walking in... So the kids come in through here, and if they need to wash their hands, well, it's right there already, hands-free, nothing to touch. These days, his team spends countless hours cleaning and disinfecting the entire campus. This includes walls, desks, bathrooms, the cafeteria, anything you can think of. I don't even count the times anymore. It's just, we got to do it. We got to go do it. We have to go do it. Their top priority... <laughs> keeping students and teachers who are back in the classroom safe. Parents entrust us with their kids, with their children, so we got to make sure they're taken care of. Quintanilla takes his job seriously, always making sure that cleaning is done thoroughly, but even more so because he, too, has a daughter who walks these halls. It's for the kids. It's for its kids, and I, I, I love my daughter, and I want to make sure she's safe, and not just mine, everyone else's kids. So I can't stress that enough. It's for the kids. Reminders to social distance and avoid shaking hands as a social greeting. <laughs> No touching. Just some of the changes visible at almost every corner. You enter a building and right away. Right. Right. Hand sanitize. See, all the handles get sprayed down. That's what the kids touch. And even if it's more work to keep the campus clean, Quintanilla doesn't mind. We're doing everything we can, everything we possibly can to make sure the kids are safe. Anything and everything gets disinfected. Again, it's all day, every day. Everything gets disinfected. That is priority number one. Monica Deanda, Channel 5 News at 6.